As COVID restrictions ease, doctors say they're seeing a spike in what's called the neurovirus, also known as the stomach flu or stomach bug. Our Kanisha D spoke with an infectious disease specialist on what causes the virus and how it impacts you after you're infected. So the norovirus uh, is a common uh, GI bug um, that can get transmitted through respiratory, but it actually causes GI, like gastroenteritis. According to the CDC, the norovirus is the most common cause of vomiting and diarrhea and foodborne illness. So far this year, Nebraska and Texas have seen a climb in norovirus cases. We see outbreaks of it, um, but it's not that common. So we see outbreak in between children, uh, between like smaller clusters, families or nursing homes and stuff. Uh, but we don't see that much of it. A person usually develops symptoms 12 to 48 hours after being exposed to norovirus and people get better within one to three days, according to the CDC. However, infectious disease specialist Dr. Ali Hassoun says you shouldn't be alarmed. And it's not as dangerous as uh, what COVID can do. But it can, like norovirus can cause dehydration, affect your other system if it goes really bad. But in general, it's a mild uh, disease. Dr. Hassoun says there really isn't any specific treatment for the virus. Staying hydrated along with other supportive measures will help. And preventative measures, according to the CDC, is to wash your hands with soap and water. A lot of these viruses, there is really no um, investment and finding antiviral, antiviral treatment for it because they usually are very short term, usually in general. Putting the Valley first, Kanisha D's WZDX News.